Okay, everybody ready? Ready. Jason, ready? Hey, I'm ready. Okay. Kind of. I'm a little tired. All right. And action. Wait. Ready? Yeah. And action. Get away from me, uh, you aliens from another planet. Leave me alone. Father, I brought you some breakfast and newspaper. Father, why are there aliens here? What's going on? Come back, daughter. I thought the um, aliens were friendly, but they're not. They're evil and gross, and they're slowly sucking the life out of me. Oh, Father. Father! Don't let them get you, daughter. I can't help you anymore. I'm dead. Help! Help! I told you I'm dead. I can't help. Somebody else who's alive! Help! Okay, cut. Um, it's not working. Yeah, no yeah. kidding. I just I don't get, feel I, inspired. Yeah, and I think it's the dialogue. <laughs> I wouldn't say that, but well, I mean... Well, it's so stiffly written, Brendan. Why am I calling her daughter? I would be calling her by her name. I'm her father, and she says, father. You know what? It's not the dialogue. It's not the daughter-father thing. It's the, uh, we need a fisheye lens. What's that? It's a lens that makes everything look weird. No, we need, um, blood capsule. Hey, Brendan, do you and all your friends want to go for ice cream? Yeah! yeah. Get it yourselves! Huh? I'm kidding! Come on, let's go! Uh, yeah. yeah! Too late! Uh, um, but... I was teasing. We're going for ice cream. Brendan, your mom's, um, funny. I know. I think it's her timing. Three cheers for Brendan's mom. 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 Stop it or I'll drop you off at the next corner. Which just happens to be next to the ice cream store. Yeah! Okay, everybody's got ice cream? Yeah! That'll be 10.50. Um, let's see. It's 10.50. Lady, I got a lot of people waiting. Uh, okay, I know. Do you have 10.50? Mm-hmm. Um... I've got two dollars. Maybe I could come back. No. Okay. Um, Brendan. Huh? Brendan, give me your ice cream. Hey. Melissa, I don't want you spoiling your dinner. But this is my dinner. Give it here. You still owe me seven fifty. Aliens, I need your ice creams. You still owe me three dollars. Okay. Dollar fifty. What do you have for fifty cents? A tip jar. Mom, but what about the whole ice cream thing? I'll take seven waters, not the bottles. Kids, they're delicious. Um, I'll make you another car. <laughs> What? What's up? How's that ice cream, Jason? Why don't you take a picture? Oof. I am full. Should have just got a single scoop, not triple. Is your mom poor, Brendan? No. No way, man. Oh, no. Oh, no. No. Man, when it rains, it pours. Go around! Oh, my I told God. I told you we should have taken the Mercedes. Huh. Very funny, Brenda. Does anybody want to rest in my cone? Go around. I'm scared. I want to go home. Sweetie, we just have to wait for help. Go around, halfway. Go around. Wow. We just have Mrs. to wait. Mrs. Small? What, Melissa? Do you want to use my cell phone to call a tow truck? Oh, um, thanks. Three cheers for Melissa's cell phone. Melissa's cell phone. Melissa's cell phone. Oh my god. Are you okay, Jason? Oh boy. Vomit. Hmm. Can you open a window? Uh, the window doesn't work. Is anybody else in here um, lactose intolerant? All right, everybody, listen up. Everybody. <laughs> That's hilarious. All right, now, as you know, we lost yesterday. Mm. Now, we all lost because of you, not because of me and the way I coach. That's my pep talk. You know, if I had a fish eye lens right now, Lugark would look so funny. Yeah. Does everybody ever want to be here? Can I enjoy it, Brendan? Brendan. Huh? You know what I went to school for? Do you? No. Architecture. Wow. Now I'm coaching elementary school soccer. Huh. You think this is a joy for me? No, it's not. On Friday, we got a big game coming up. We're playing East Central. You probably don't know this, but Coach McGurk went to East Central. And my soccer coach, Coach Ralph, he's still coaching for East Central. Now, coach Ralph was a mentor to me. He taught me everything I know. And on Friday, when we play his team, East Central, I can't think of a better way to thank him for being my mentor and to cheat and win. 
Oh, if anybody has any ideas on how to win, how to beat a way better team, raise your hand and tell me right now. Because there's no way we're going to win on our own. This is so cool. Melissa, <laughs> what? you look so funny. Let me see. Wait, Jason, you look really goofy and weird. Uh, <laughs> that looks really funny. That's rather harsh. Can I look now, Brendan? Oh my gosh, this is so awesome. We could make so many cool movies with that thing. <laughs> Brendan, you look like a creepy, freaky kid. Ooh. Stop. How do you feel, Rosemary? Uh, Melissa, can I look now, please? Sure, Jason. What's the big deal? It, it, the image is all distorted, isn't it? Doesn't everything look weird, Jason? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so isn't that funny? Uh, <laughs> Good. Brendan, um, I wouldn't buy this. Huh? The fisheye lens is kind of a tired device. No. Is it really worth it? It's rather hackneyed. Um, you can put my name on this bad boy, my good man, because I'll be back to buy it very, very soon. Well, we close in an hour. Oh, no, I mean soon, like in a few days soon, or, you know, weeks or something. Soon, not now. Excuse me? Is this where one goes to make a withdrawal? This window's for deposits only. Ha! How are you doing there, Mom? Kind of busy, Brendan. Of course. It's busy running a household. How do you do it, Mom? How do you run a household and still look so good? Okay, Brendan, what is it? I want to ask you something. Sure, sweetie. You've got one minute. Whoa, I, I've been uh, timing this pitch and it takes five minutes, so... Okay, well, you've got four and a half. Come on! Four twenty. Okay, 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 here goes, here goes. Mom, are you familiar with the term slipped him a mickey? As in, someone slipped that guy a Mickey, and now everybody looks weird to him. Brendan, what are you talking about? A fisheye lens. I need a fisheye lens. No pets, Brendan. No, Mom, it's not a fish. It's a fisheye lens. You put it on your camera, and you make images look weird. You know what? I would love to get you a fish's lens, Brendan. No, but fish eye lens, Mom. Yeah, but you know what? I can't afford it right now. The car has to be fixed, and that's going to set us back a bit. In fact, Brendan, uh, until further notice, we are officially on a budget. Oh, There's not gonna no. Be no additional spending for a while. No, I'm talking about Funhouse Mirror Weird here. I know here. what you're talking about, Brendan, and I know your films are important to you, but right now, you know what? It's going to have to wait. <laughs> Hmm. The pipe burst. Oh my, oh Jesus. Oh, no, 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 it's fine. No. I got it. No, I got it. Oh Everything's my God. under oh control. My. What, what is going worry. on? I got it. Don't worry about it. I don't just, Mom, go take a nap. I've got this under control. Uh, anyway, it's a, you know, it's a, so it's a fish eye lens. You'll sleep on it and we'll talk tomorrow. Okay? Can you hand me a towel, please? Uh -huh. Oh, fish. You don't know how lucky you are to see the world through your fisheye eyes. But someday I'll get a fisheye lens and then I'll be just like you. Mom, the car's in the shop and the sink sprung a leak and, uh, uh, <clears throat> mom, 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 I was wondering if I could borrow some money. I'll pay you back. Mom, I'm in a little bit of a financial pickle here. Mom? And, oh, Brendan, um, yeah. I, I didn't hear you come in. It's because you have a banana in your ear. It's an earring. Do you are like you, Are you talking to me? Should I pick up a tangerine and listen? <laughs> you know what? It's nothing. I'll explain it later. Sounded like you were practicing asking Grandma for some money. Oh, don't be ridiculous, Brendan. What an imagination. Look, I want in. Forget it. No, I want in. No, you're going to bed. No, Mom, it's 6.30. Look, I can help you. Okay, what are you talking about, Brendan? I have some advice on asking Grandma for money if that is, in fact, what you were talking to the banana about. I don't need your help in asking my parents for money. That's just... Besides, I wasn't going to ask them for money. I don't okay. even know why All I'm right. discussing fine. this with fine. you. Fine, fine. But uh, if you want to talk about it, I'll be right over here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm curious. What advice do you have? Number one, you got to do it in person. you got to go over there. Why? Because you have to compliment what they're wearing. Then you find their weakness, their tell. Uh -huh. There's an old saying, Mom. If you sit down at a card game and you don't know who the sucker is... Uh, then it's probably you. Yeah. Look, look, Mom, you gotta, you gotta see what works on them. You gotta draw it out of them. You, like uh, when I drop my chin to my chest and look up at you with my puppy dog eyes. Like, oh, I gave that look five dollars last week. Gotcha. That's why you have to go over to their house. And you gotta get them into a card game. Cards? There's the queen. Okay, now find the lady, Mom. Keep your eye on the lady. Where's the lady, right Mom? Right there. Uh, right there. No, none of them. See, now you okay. owe me 20 bucks. One more time. Let's do it face up. Ow! Is that 
Stop using your nose. Oh. I need you to practice as much as you can before Friday's game. You know how important this is to me. Yeah, I thought you were going to get high school kids to play in our places. Yeah, what happened to that? Too much money. Yeah. Al. Coach McGurk, I actually have to leave soon, so I, I can't Although stick around. Although I must say, it is funny when you use your face. <laughs> Ow. See? Well, Coach, I have to leave because I have to go get a job. A job? Ow. Brendan, you're only five years old. What do you need a job for? I'm eight, and I want to save up some money so I can buy a fisheye lens. Ow. Yeah. No, wait, stop! Hey, stop, I'm up here! Say somebody, somebody's up here! Hey! Hey, what baby on board! Help! Knock, knock! Help! You know, I have, I have things filed in a very specific way. Yeah. You, you're familiar with the alphabet, right? Uh, most of it. Well, you know, I, I use a slightly different filing system, so forget the alphabet if you can. Done. It's a system I invented years ago with my younger brother. And it was inspired by the Dewey Decimal System, but it's really my own system. Right. For instance, if you have a house for sale, mm -hmm. and it's a uh, three-bedroom house, right. I would sort that under the letter T. <laughs> okay. If you're looking to buy a house, and you're a single parent, uh -huh. I sort it under S. All right. If you're not interested in buying a house, uh -huh. I don't even file it. Huh. Because I'm only interested in people who are either buying or selling houses, because I'm in the real estate business. Right. I don't worship the ground they walk on, but I buy and sell the things that are built on the ground they walk on. Okay, well, just, uh, I'll be... And also, you know, I get a lot of phone calls. I can answer the phone. So if someone calls, the trick is not to say that I'm here, just to say that um, you're going to check and see if I'm available. Okay. You know, so if someone calls, you say, you say, real estate, who's calling? You get the name and they say, can you hold? I'll see if he's available. Okay. You want to practice one? I'll, I'll pretend I'm calling. Okay. You, you answer the phone. Oh, okay. Real, real estate. Wait, first you say hello. Brrr. Hello. Real estate. <laughs> Who's calling, please? Is Eric there? Yeah, I'll get him. Hold on. Eric? <laughs> <laughs> you have to say you're going to see if he's available. Oh, okay. That's such a critical step. All right. Do you get the idea, Brendan, how this works? Yeah, I think so. Can we try one where I call you? Uh, Yeah, but but just the other thing is... Ring. If... Hello. Hi. Hi. How's it going? Okay, you know, I'm just... What are you doing today? I'm training uh, one of the what kids. Are you doing, what are you doing after that? Going out for a drink. Okay. I gotta get going. Can I tell them who's calling? You familiar with shredding documents? It's just shredding paper, right? Yeah, these are just files that I no longer need and they take up a lot of space. Okay. And if we don't shred them, uh, somebody's gonna go away for a very long time. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> so if you could just shred all these documents, that would be great. Documents? Yeah, you put the documents in the feeder... Uh -huh. And then you push red, and, and the rest happens pretty much automatically. Can we do a practice one? Yeah. Okay. Hello? You just say Eric's Real Estate. Eric's Real Estate. And now push shred. Shred. Can you handle it? Yeah. I am really sorry. You said all the files. I thought you meant everything and all the drawers and everything everywhere. Eric, are you, are you sure there's nothing I can do for you? I'm so sorry. No. Well, technically, all the documents are still here. They're not gone. Yeah. They're just disassembled, and if you want me to, I can go through them and uh, try to reassemble them. No, that's okay. All right, we'll hang out the rest of the day? No, I don't think that's necessary. So am I fired or uh... Not at all. In fact, I'm going to give you some time off. A vacation? Thank you. Can we just talk about payment really quickly? You know what? I shredded your check by mistake, and I'm sure you understand how that can happen. Huh. Oh, well. So, uh, <sighs> what's next on the uh, agenda? You know, I think in your own childish way, you've stumbled across a an entirely new filing system for me. Right. This is the paperless office that I've been reading about. That's what I was going to say. What, what, what is this? That's a lettuce. Guess what kind? I'm going to say romaine. You're right. That's a tortilla right there. That worked out nicely. Mm -hmm. That's, you know, I'll tell you what does not shred nicely is um, that plum. Oh, because of the pit? The pit, kind of like I had to get in there with a screwdriver, which is... Uh, yeah. You know, one of the things I'm most proud of as a, as a parent is that I've never struck a child. Yeah. But I'm willing to be proud of something else today. <laughs> Hi, Brandon. Hey. Hi, Brandon. Hey. How's work, you chump? Um, it's hard work. Work got you down, sucker. Jason, he could get us free ice cream. 
guy. But I am glad you guys stopped by because I wanted to pitch you guys an idea for a movie. Great. What is it? Picture this. Uh, it's about an ice cream worker with a dream. Okay, and our hero hopes that one day he will invent the best ice cream in the world. But while working on it, he eats some bad ice cream, and he gets all dizzy, and everything starts to look weird and creepy. So, Brandon, and do we need a fish eye lens for this? Yeah. Well, how close are you to buying it? Brandon, we can call it Ice Dreams. How much do you get paid here anyway? Actually, uh, Melissa, they haven't hired me. Yet. They haven't? No. Wow, Brandon, you are a I, I, I figure if I come over here every day and do a good job, then, you know, they'll have to pay me something. All right, that's smart, Brandon. Hold out for money. I think it shows good initiative, Brendan. Hey, kid, I told you go home. <clears throat> How, uh, how's school, Brendan? School is, uh, uh, just terrific, Grandpa. My teachers love me. You should go to school. Well, I do. Hmm. School is good. Well, I mean, that's why I go. Yeah. Gramps? Mm. Yeah, I'm doing well on uh, sports. I'm playing uh, soccer. I'm, I'm the best, just uh, in general, you know. What? Wait, wait, hold on. Watch, uh, watch your grandfather do this right now. Hold on. Mm. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> Why'd you do that? On. I can't control my... <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I don't give two dams. Yeah. Oh, Grandpa. No, no, but except for this, this is the only time I enjoy myself. When I get visitors like you, Brendan. You know, I'm going to cheer you up. Hmm? Y you seem like a guy that likes to take a chance with his money. And, uh, hey, you don't play cards, do you? Sure. What do you play? <laughs> you ever heard of a uh, three-card Monty? You want to play uh, poker? I play poker. So, Mom, how's it going? It's fine, Brendan. Everything's fine. You know, you shouldn't wait till the last minute to ask. I'll handle this, okay? I don't want you worrying about our financial situation. Maybe next year you can worry about it. <laughs> well, thank Get you a little box of worry. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, um, not to make matters worse or anything, but I owe Grandpa $60. Paula, make sure you save all the leftovers. I can get a couple of meals out of that for me and your father. Uh, uh... Oops. Start digging. Hmm. Thank you so much for the loan, Mom. I really appreciate it. Don't worry about it, Paula. Hello, fisheye lens. <laughs> All right, everybody huddle up. That was a great game, all right? A great game. You know, I'm so proud of you kids. But we didn't even win, Coach McGurk. We tied. Yeah, uh, Coach, isn't a tie like the same thing as kissing your sister? Yeah. Huh. All right, so nice job, team. Congratulations. Thanks. Go home, get some rest. Sorry Coach Ralph didn't show up. Hey, what happened to that guy? Well, let me tell you a little story. Coach Ralph doesn't exist. He was a figment of my imagination. See, Melissa, you owe me 20 bucks now. You're right, a bet's a bet. Sorry, guys. It's sometimes, though, I have to tell stories in order to inspire my team, so I made up a fictitious coach named Ralph. That's 20 bucks, Melissa. Who was you. like a mentor of mine. Let's be honest, I never had a mentor. So maybe Jerry Lee Lewis. But beyond that, no, I don't have any soccer mentors. As a matter of fact, I just started playing the game a year ago. Oh, okay, so my mom said I could pay her back uh, a little bit every week, so... I... Hello. You want to look at the lens again? Oh, uh, yeah. No, actually. Um, this time, I want to buy it. Oh, really? I'll have it to go, please. That lens won't fit on this camera. Oh. Um, huh. Well, then, um, would, what, would I just need a different camera, or...? Yeah. And about how much is, how much is that? $1,400. Brennan, that's a lot more expensive than the other one. I know! I mean, that's really expensive. I can't expensive. afford that. And my mom can't afford it. Nobody can afford that. Who's got Brandon, four fucking Brandon. hundred dollars? I'm really sorry. I am so mad at you. I mean, at the situation. At the situation. Brendan, let's go. You know what? Mm -hmm. Brendan, come on. Come no. on, let's go. Brendan, it's Chinatown. There's nothing you can do. What is that supposed to mean? From the movie Chinatown. I didn't see Chinatown. I guess we'll have to make movies without fisheye lenses. Yeah. Thanks a lot, mister. My pleasure. Well, any um, good director works within his limitations. Three cheers, cheers for Brandon, for Brandon. For Brandon. Thank for you. Brandon. Is uh, everybody enjoying their ice creams? Yeah. 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 Thanks, Brendan. Brendan, this is a wonderful gesture, but I'd rather see you save your money. Let me give you the money for these, please. Mom. I've learned a little bit about money these last few days. Not a lot, but a little. And so my answer to you is, 
Yes, of course. I would love for you to pay for these. Huh? I mean, who do you think I am buying everybody ice cream? I'm just a kid. Great speech, my man. I'm a little short here. Jason Payer? <laughs>